Wait, can I get a mint julep, please? Sure. I still have to pay to watch it. Mint julep. Mint Mint juleps on Thurby Day. WHS 11's Rachel Droz has been covering the big day today since the gates opened this morning. And how did Thurby go? The big return. Rachel? Yeah, Doug, there is a ton of excitement down here. Of course, this is the first time we're back at full capacity since 2019 before the pandemic. And there is a big crowd and it just seems to keep getting bigger as we have gone through this day. My favorite part is seeing all of the outfits, as I'm sure it is many people's favorite parts, women sporting their lovely hats and fascinators and men looking quite dapper in their preppy outfits. But the Downs isn't just known for great fashion. It's also known for great drinks. The iconic mint julep, the crowd favorite Lily, but many have opt to avoid lines at the bars and get their adult beverages from vendors like Nathan Page. Page, who is from St. Louis, is a professional vendor. He travels the country selling concessions at different sporting events. This is his 12th year coming to the Downs. They put you on a list and they ask you, do you want to sell mint juleps or a beer? And why are you selling the beer? Why stand in line? Because you can buy one of mine. <laughs> and betting on the horse races, one of the major draws for many coming to the track. One man we talked to ended up winning the first race he put money down on today. I asked her 97-year-old grandfather, it's his birthday on Sunday, happy birthday, Papa. Um, give me a number one to ten. And he said number five. And I said, all right, first race tomorrow, we'll bet the five horse then. Well, upon seeing he had the worst odds, we just threw 20 bucks on him to show, but he came in second. So we're one for one on the day. And of course, all of us at WHAS 11 are wishing Mr. William Columbia a very happy birthday, which he is going to be celebrating later this weekend, turning 97 years old. Everyone out here, me included, is very happy that it appears this rain is holding out, allowing all the people, the locals, to celebrate this Thurby in apparently dry conditions so far. But I am starting to feel some sprinkles, so I will uh, definitely report back at 6. For now, reporting live at Churchill Downs, Rachel Droz, WHAS 11, on your side.